Hi guys, it's your girl Brianna Cater here and I am back yet again with a different video. So today I'll be using Carol's Daughters for a Soul Clay line on my hair at the very stressful and active week of finals, actually two weeks of finals. My hair is dry, dull, lifeless, and your girl is not popping. Like, it looks bad as you all can see. <laughs> However, Carol's Daughter's Raw Soul Clay line is to the rescue. I'm so excited to try this line. I've been seeing it on everyone's Instagram. Seven. So now the first step is to wash my hair with the Raw Soul Clay Sulfate Free Shampoo. I only used about one pump. And you get so much, so that's a really good thing. Now you're just going to put it in just this section right here. Now I'm going to add some water because your girl's hair is dry. Look how fast I'm just able to detangle my hair. I've never been able to detangle my hair with a shampoo, ever. I'm already liking this shampoo. I already gave it a 5 out of 5. So right here guys, I really just wanted to give you all a little close up and look how shiny that shampoo is. And again, just detangling with just the shampoo. It only had a little bit of shedding, so that's not bad. And these curls are popping. Like, look at that. And this is the shedding just from this side with the curls. So pretty. And make sure you get your edges. For me, I always have build up because of gel and edge control on my edges. This part is actually the hardest part of my hair. Seven. So now I'm only using three pumps of the Rinching Conditioner for one subsection of my hair. Remember, a little goes a long way with this line, so that's a really amazing thing. And I'm just so easily able to detangle my hair. I look how my comb slides through. I really could just use my fingers, to be honest. Again, only a little bit of shedding. So now I'm just going to twist my hair so it doesn't get retangled. Just take the excess conditioner and just put it at the roots of your hair. Just like that. But I got a little piece of hair in my mouth so I was really disgusted and it was really nasty. You guys, this part of my hair is so hard for me to detangle because my curl pattern is a lot looser in the front versus it is in the back. And I've broken combs, made blow dryers catch on fire just from this one section of hair in the front of my head and I hate it but I didn't have that problem this time so now I twisted all of my hair and I'm going to unravel it before I rinse out the conditioner now I'm giving y'all Donna Summers Miss with Diana Ross puffy realness because my hair is so light and fluffy and I love it it's so amazing you guys now it's time for the best part the raw soul clay softening hair mask i was so anxious to try this this is my first time ever using carol's daughter's deep conditioners It didn't smell too bad, so that's a good thing. It really didn't have a smell, to be honest. And remember, in this line, a little goes a long way. So you really don't need a lot. You could actually use a dime size of everything. Even though a dime size to naturals is really about a quarter size. But not in this case. And make sure you're putting the conditioners from roots to ends. Seven. Right 
my hair on my hair I like to do two separate sub sections in one section so my hair doesn't get retangled again and also this is just a quick little close-up so you can see what the deep conditioner looks like remember a little goes a long way so you won't need a lot for per section Seven. Get them edges, sis. Get them edges. We gotta make sure we protect our edges at all times. Now I'm just gonna pull my hair back and put it in my butterfly clip just to make sure my hair gets all the moisture that it needs. Now I'm going to take my handy dandy plastic cap and I'm going to place it on my hair so my hair retains all the moisture from the deep conditioner. Then I'm going to take my shower cap and just to put it on top just so I can have a little added help to my hair when I'm deconditioning. Now I'm going to leave it in for 10 minutes. That's all you need to leave it in or you can do less than 10 minutes. Hey guys, so this is what my hair looks like from rinsing out the deep conditioner. And now it's time for me to get my life so I can do my hair and start looking like who's sharp, Brianna. I'm using Silk Tentacles Twisting Butter, by the way. So guys, this is what my hair looks like after just using the Soul Tentacles Twisting Butter. I am the queen of flat twisting my hair because that's what I always do. Guys, this is the only bit of shedding that I had for my hair. So now I'm going to twist and roll my hair. My hair is still very wet, by the way. So just keep twisting and rolling. And that's all you have to do. I'm teaching you all a different style of what I do with my hair when I do a flat twist. Take your bobby pin and you're going to pin it into your hair. The key to this style is honestly just to twist and roll, twist and roll, and use your bobby pins. I like to do this style so my hair could dry fully, like if I have somewhere to go and I don't want to leave my hair looking just, you know, kind of crazy. Just to kind of make it look a little more, you know, classy. And also do my hair like this when I wear my wigs. So I remember twist and roll, tuck and roll, and adding your bobby pins. Seven. guys and this only thing you're doing is twisting tucking rolling and adding your bobby pins that is all and by the way it gets your little grecian goddess you know vibes and i just think it's just so cute even though i look like a 12 year old okay guys that concludes my video and i love this line and this is the one that i will most mainly use from carol's daughter please like subscribe and comment see you guys soon